the long walk hurdle is next is a grade one three mile one furlong hurdle for the older horses and at the top we've got add insult to injury for Joshua Sutherland, Benny Hill, David Robertson, Cap on Target, John Morgan, Cottage Wine, Craig Beckwith, Darsage, Strange, James Shea, Feel the Fear, Craig Beckwith, Sierra Vista, Cheese, Vinnie Gerard, Sudden Excuse, Darren Thompson, Zaru Zeus for Patrick Hogan, Casa Grande Smiles, Vinnie Gerard, Isabella of Castile for Leon Van Rensburg, Lady Sharona, and Seminal Word for Alex Cherry, and Twilight Wolf for Leon Van Rensburg down the bottom. A field of 14 then, called in underway. Add insult to injury and Dasid Strange dispute the lead at the first. All good over and over can now right over on the far side, Lady Sharona. I thought she might get the knack of being in the lead, but it's Lady Sharona who's going to take it up from Dasid Strange in second. And add insult to injury is third. Benny Hill and Cam on target as they take the second. Not safely over the second. And Alex Cherry top and tail in the field just about. With Lady Sharona and a seminal word. Head towards the third of 14. And safely over that as well with Lady Sharona White on the track just to lead it. I'm adding sorts of injury down on this near side. Then comes Benny Hill back in third. Darcy Strange and Casa Grande Smiles. Really wide on the track is Cab on target. Isabella of Castile and Zaru Zeus are also pretty wide on the track. The one that's widest of all is Sudden Excuse in the maroon with the white sleeves well that's tucked in just a little bit now Sierra Vista Cheese is just a back marker but it's Lady Sharona who's in front um, add insult to injury second and Benny Hill um, Casa Grande smiles and Darcy Strange with Cap on target over on the far side Zaru Zeus and Cottage Wine next with Isabella of Castile and Feel the Fear Excuse continues to be the tail end Charlie as they get over the fifth. No, right over the fifth. Nicely. And this leader has now opened up by a good six or seven. Who add insult to injury. Who's heading the chasing pack. Chucky just taking a bit of a tug on the leader, I think, to stop it getting too far ahead. And it's probably about five lengths now. Add insult to injury second. Benny Hill third. Dusty Strange fourth. Then Cab on target on the outside is fifth. And the cottage wine close up, then Zaru Zeus. And Twilight Wolf as they step over number six. And we'll safely over that. And heading up the straight. And I'll take the flight, that'll be the last. Next time round. Shortly, in front of the stand. All over that one again, although Leon Van Rensburg is better of Castile. Didn't jump it all that well. Lady Sharona, leading only by four net as they come past the big stand, past the winning post, and then they'll head out for a complete circuit of the track. We had Lady Sharona, four lengths clear in the lead from adding salt to injury, cab on target, and Benny Hill. Then comes Sierra Vista Cheese and Darcy Strange. Between the two of them, Zaru Zeus, the two Leon Van Rensburg horses are wider on the track. Twilight Wolf and Isabella of Castile, the two Craig Beckwith horses are down on this near side. Feel the fear and Cottage Wine. And the blue cap of Alex Cherry's second runner, Seminal Word, has gone past the second. Or Vinnie Gerard, that's Casa Grande, smiles in the two shades of green towards the back. And then the back marker, Darren Thompson's sudden excuse in the maroon with a white sleeve. So they're heading down the back part of the track now and then jumping over flight number eight. And they're all safely over number eight. They're all still on their feet. All going well enough within themselves, I would guess. Nobody's sending out any distress signs anyway. Lady Sharona is still too clear. They're back up to three again as they take flight number nine. Pack are definitely getting much closer though. And adding salt to injury just ahead of the rest of them. Darcy Strange. A close up third, then comes Benny Hill, Sierra Vista Cheese, Twilight Wolf, and Cottage One, Zaru Zeus. There's plenty of chances. Look at this sudden excuse has got into it now as well. He's only about eight lengths off the lead, but Lady Sharona continuing to 
Hang on in front, leads by the best part of two lengths to add insult to injury in the second. Sierra Vista Cheese is probably just third, but there's a big group of about ten or so of them in that group there who could all still play a part in the finish. In fact, you wouldn't actually rule seven a word out of it entirely. But it's Lady Sharona leading only by a neck now. And add insult to injury on the outside. Then come Cottage Wine and Phil the Fear are both getting considerably closer. Casa Grande Smiles is also making good ground around the outside and so too is this sudden excuse. Twilight Wolf is in there with a chance as well but Lady Sharona is batting on in front and still is in front by about half a length to add insult to injury in second. Benny Hill has moved back into third. Then Sierra Mr. G. Grando Smiles is on the outside. Then Feel the Fear over the 12th. They go. That was a third last and Lady Sharona is still in front by about a length to add insult to injury is under a bit of pressure. Then wide on the track, Casa Grande Smiles, he's the better of Castile and Twilight Wolf are still there so is Benny Hill, so is Feel the Fear and Sudden Excuse, he's wide open this one but Lady Sharona is continuing to battle away in front, Lady Sharona is now too clear, but in second place Twilight Wolf and Benny Hill are starting to close, Feel the Fear also adding salt to injury, just hit a bit of a flat spot Casa Grande Smiles and Sierra Vista Cheese widen now, Twilight Wolf takes it up over the second last, Twilight Wolf hits the front and suddenly starts to motor away, we're being chased by Feel the Fear, Benny Hill's in third then Sierra Mr. Cheese and Casa Grande Smiles racing down towards the final flight and Twilight Wolf is suddenly three or four clear Twilight Wolf comes into the final flight looking like he needs a good jump to sew it up and that's what he's got there's a furlong still to go Twilight Wolf is four lengths clear of Sierra Mr. Cheese who's moving into second Phil the final is still there in third then comes in the banner of Castile but it's going to be Twilight Wolf who's going to take the long walk and Twilight Wolf will race up towards the line and take it pretty comfortably from a fast finishing Sierra Vista Chief second is the winner of Castile third then Phil the Fear and from sorts of injury cab on target next to Lady Sharona in the end drop right out to be last which is a bit of a shame because she ran such a good race for most of the way round and Twilight World for Leon van Rensburg the big guns firing today and Takes that one nicely. Sierra Vista Chiefs for Finney Gerard. Only a six year old was second. Isabella of Castile, Leon van Rensburg third. Feel the fear. Craig Beck with fourth. And add insult to injury for Joshua Sutherland was back in fifth. <laughs>